Alrighty, now before I begin, may I just say, holy damn, Leonard is getting so big. Look at all of that primary growth. I mean, seriously. Next thing you know, he's going to be moving out. Rather than do a traditional introductory video, I thought I would try something a little bit different. Now, I got this idea from one of Amazing Phil's old videos, so kudos to him. And if you haven't checked out his channel, I would definitely suggest that. So, without further ado, welcome to A to Z of G! Autumn, my favorite time of the year! B for biology and bronze. C for coffee, because without it, I would be a zombie. D for dry hands. Now my hands are always dry because I work in a bakery and I have to wash my hands like a zillion times a day. E stands for English, the only language I can speak properly. Sometimes. F stands for food, obviously. G stands for glasses, because without them I would be so screwed. H stands for heat, something I cannot stand. I stands for indigo, one of my favorite colors. J stands for juice, because I don't drink pop. Or soda, whatever you call it. K stands for carry on my wayward son. Oh, no. L stands for Leonard, my plant child. M stands for mug. N stands for nearly witches, one of my favorite songs. O stands for one bright day in the middle of the night. Two dead boys got up to fight my favorite home. P stands for panic at the disco and parasites. Q stands for quiet because I can be very, very quiet. R stands for rain of disease, which means that my hands turn really weird colors. S stands for Supernatural, and also Starbucks! T stands for this horrible word I cannot pronounce. U stands for University. V stands for Virgo, because I was born on September 18th. W stands for Wigs, because I am a cosplayer. X. X is just a really, really weird letter. Y stands for YouTube. Z stands for Z, because here in Canada, we say Z, not Z. There is my A to Z of G. And if you would like more videos like this and would like to be notified, feel free to subscribe. I'll put that right over here by my plant children, Philip and Leonard. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. And I'm going to go eat the rest of my lunch because it's currently, I don't know, quarter to one. And I haven't had breakfast yet. Have a good day!